Fantastic. Thank you so much. How are you guys doing? Fine. Any New Year's oh, resolutions? Yeah. Any New Year's resolutions? How's married life? Sucks. 10 Things You Didn't Know About Ellen Pompeo and Chris Ivory's Relationship For over a decade now, Ellen Pompeo has starred on one of TV's most successful shows ever as Meredith Grey on Grey's Anatomy, and with her skill at staying out of the spotlight, many forget she has a life outside of the show. For over 13 years she has been married to music producer Chris Ivory and despite many rumors and supposed scandals the two have stuck together and are stronger than ever with their three children. Get to know the stunning couple better with 10 things you didn't know about their relationship. How they met. Two years before Grey's Anatomy premiered, Belle and Pompeo met Chris Ivory while at a grocery store in LA. After the meeting the two remained friends, but did not actually start dating until six months later when Ivory said, one night she just looked different to me. Meanwhile Pompeo has admitted she knew he was the one early in their relationship. They go way back. Although they met in LA in 2003, the pair quickly learned that they had way more in common than they realized, and it brought them closer together. The two soon discovered that they both grew up just outside of Boston and then found out their childhood homes were only about 10 miles away from each other. She has always insisted that because of these coincidences she has always felt they were destined to be together. They were on punked. Back in 2005 when Ashton Kutcher was still the host and Grey's Anatomy was brand new, Belle and Pompeo was a victim on Punked in Season 6. Ivory was Kutcher's accomplice in punking Pompeo and it definitely worked. Kutcher had Pompeo and Ivory eating a restaurant with a very attractive waitress and at the end Ivory tipped the waitress a huge amount of money for no reason. The ploy worked and Pompeo became extremely angry with both Ivory and the waitress before realizing it was all a setup. The Engagement in November 2006 on Pompeo's 37th birthday, Ivory finally popped the question with a stunning 3.5 carat diamond ring. Pompeo said she was surprised, but felt it would be coming soon. The Wedding Before she was even engaged, Pompeo insisted that she and Ivory would be married in secret and she didn't change her mind after their engagement. In fact, in November 2007 the two left LA for New York and were married in a small ceremony where New York City Mayor Michael Bloomberg served as their witness and the ceremony was performed at City Hall by a city clerk. After the inconspicuous union, the pair took in a New York Knicks game at Madison Square Gardens before returning to Hollywood so Pompeo could continue filming Grey's. Cheating Rumors Despite now being together for over 13 years, Ellen Pompeo and Chris Ivory's entire relationship has been consistently plagued by rumors of cheating and scandal. In 2009, it seemed like Pompeo's worst fears from her episode of Punked had come true when a Boston waitress Rachel Ertz came forward saying she had slept with Ivory several times. Pompeo's rep denied the affair and the couple powered through together and then in 2012 more rumors made headlines when Ivory was apparently openly hitting on a 26-year-old woman at a Guns N' Roses concert. An eyewitness stated that Chris was very persistent and asked the woman for her phone number a number of times and also asked her to go home with him multiple times, but she didn't do it. As before, Pompeo and Ivory ignored the vicious rumors and have continued to live happily in their relationship together. Welcoming Children Two years after their wedding, Pompeo gave birth to the couple's first child, daughter Stella Luna in 2009. Then in 2014 they welcomed their second daughter, Sienna, via surrogate and kept the birth a secret for two months before making their big announcement. They surprised everyone once again in December 2016 when they welcomed their third child, and second by surrogate, a boy named Eli Christopher. Net Worth while everyone is aware that Pompeo has become one of TV's highest-earning actress thanks to her long-running role on Grey's Anatomy, much less is known about Ivory's career. Chris Ivory is Harvard-educated and works as a record producer, and also has his own millions. Together Pompeo and Ivory have an estimated net worth of $45 million. Of that incredible amount, Ivory brings an estimated $10 million to the table through his work and Pompeo brings in the remaining $35 million. Dating an Actress when Pompeo and Ivory first met, Grey's Anatomy was still two years away from its premiere, but when it did, Ivory had to contend with his wife becoming one of TV's most popular actresses, as well as her iconic romantic storyline with Patrick Dempsey's character. Using a surrogate Although the couple welcomed their first daughter naturally, the pair have welcomed their last two by surrogate and while Pompeo has never explained why they have used surrogacy, she did open up about the process. How does that work exactly? I'm, pardon my ignorance on no, that. No, that's but okay. With, when you have the baby through the surrogate, mm -hmm. um, how do, does your husband visit her uh, in a <laughs> motel room? No, it's no, right. so, so medically Chris Ivory, you know, has to do what he has to do and provide what he has to provide. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. 
And then I have to I had to provide something as well. Okay, you know, I, I had get to do it. something as well. Okay, they that makes sense. have to retrieve sense. the egg. Uh -huh. And then they put it together in a in a dish, the the lab technicians, and then they make the embryo and then they insert the embryo into the woman who will carry the child. Wow. And um, you know, this is an incredible thing to do with your life. Yeah. To uh, give the gift of carrying someone's child. Yeah, so I for am forever sure. grateful and feel very blessed and grateful to her. And uh, she who will re remain anonymous. Mm -hmm.